Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Sean here, back showing you all of my tattoo machines. I have eight, three, three here, four, and four here. So, I want to plug these in and give you a rundown of what you're dealing with when you oh, crap. when you strike up your tattoo machine and it's not gonna work out. I might have to pause this. I have to pause this. There we go. Say, if we had a tube to make this work right, but I just want you guys to see how loud these are. That one's pretty loud. Here, hold on a second. Okay, that was your standard machine. This here is a rotary. I'm just gonna fire it up and see how loud it is. See that little knob go up and down? There we go, that's what I'm talking about. So, I'll do one more rotary, because my other rotary isn't that quiet. Hold on one second. Okay, we're going to go with this rotary. It's quiet, but not as quiet as that other one. Not as quiet as the red one. So we're going to pause this. Okay, we're going to try this old antique. Um, I'm not too sure which is older. This one, which I got in 97 from my tattoo artist back in the day. Or this one, which I got from one of my friends, but this is a pretty old machine. Um, those are actual nine millimeter Luger. Uh, you can see that when nine millimeter Luger, they're nine millimeter Luger slugs that have been sawed off. And I have two more of these but this one doesn't have the bullets and this one is a replica of this one so honestly I don't know which machine is older but to say the least uh, we're gonna go at it see what we got see what we can compare here well that would probably be kind of quiet but uh, something's something's messed up here I'm gonna have to get one of my tattoo buddies over to take a look at it because I'm not that experienced to know what's going on with these machines when they malfunction like that. Alright, so hold it, give me one more second. And this one, if you remember, that is a little metal clip that just goes right inside there it's pretty crazy 
And I'm going to let you watch this because this is kind of funny. Watch it. <laughs> it jumps. But you can barely hear the sound on that one. And then it draws like a pen. And I'm not left handed, so it's not a good representation of drawing. But you get the the hint here of this little bad boy and as you turn up the speed on the dial it's at 5 8 now I can go up to I'll go up 8 1 and the higher that your speed is the um, more power you get to your machine. I'm gonna show you this again. <laughs> this you can hear it a little bit better now, but it's amazing how much power you can hold in this little tattoo machine. Um, one of my tattoo artists, the lady I was telling you about that uh, was giving me a hard time about these, this unit with, with the power supply and the foot, foot switch. Um, anyways, she was telling me that I probably wouldn't like the pen either but maybe because I'm, I've never tattooed anything or anybody that I might just be more accustomed to drawing with the pen. I don't know. I think she's crazy. Because I stuck pens, pencils, in this machine for years so I could getting accustomed to the weight. Give me one second. I drew with pencils like this for about um, five years before I met her and a buddy of mine. And I tell you what, getting used to to getting accustomed to drawing like this with the weight on the back of the pencil is just like tattooing. Honestly, it, you got you don't have a pen, uh, an eraser. You're just going by what you know, and I don't know. It's crazy. I wouldn't say it's just like tattooing, but it's very, very similar. And I don't know. Everybody cracks me up, though. But we're gone nine minutes. Another long, drawn out video for you guys. You guys can all bash me in the comments. I mean, how retarded I am for. Wasting your time. <laughs> Anyways, I'll talk to y'all later. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. And uh, definitely comment. Let me know what you guys think about this. Alright? Because I'm pretty stoked about it. And um, yeah. So take care. Have a good night. Good day. Whatever. Wherever or however you're seeing this video. Take care.